my world. <laughs> DPTV Networks up in Nyack, New York. About to check out a film festival. Nyack Film Festival. We're about to see Evulsion, Speed Suit. We just got the word from Richard and Carolyn that we are welcome to stay till 11 p.m. because we're media. So thanks, guys. Yes, thank you very much. And um, just to let you know, we got here a little early, so we stopped down to this uh, nice little restaurant, Harry's Burritos. Really nice, so I recommend if you're up in Nyack, definitely come and... Uh, Get your burrito on. And every Sunday at 5.30, kids can watch TV on the big screen oh, yeah. while the parents have happy hour. That's cool. So, so yeah. no need a babysitter. So that, yeah, so <laughs> if you want to get, you know, drop off the kids, you know, have them watch a movie, you can still get your drink on at Harry's Burrito. Date night. On a Sunday. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and not to mention, they have the greatest chips and dip. Mm -hmm. The salsa dip is going on. So, once again, Harry's Burrito, Nike, New York. Check it out. DPTV Network. Free book bags for kids next Saturday, August 25th, from 12 to 4. So, if you're in the New Jersey area, you can come on out to the Willing Heart Center. That's, um, well, the church is 149 Springfield Avenue, and the Willing Heart Center is a couple doors to the, on the side of it. To the Depending left. on where you come in. Yeah, from. I mean, you know, you're coming from the left, you go to your right. You come from the right, right. right. you go to the left. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> and that's where it is. Yeah, yeah. Can't miss it. Yeah. Next Saturday, August 25th. Okay, we actually uh, waited for the movie to get it out. Yo, these bad boys is good too. I do recommend it. I highly recommend it. Well, here comes my guacamole. Don't forget. So I didn't claim that Palm is paying for this check. Let me just say, I treat my boss sometimes. Harry's burrito. Chloe McLean, she's lovely, isn't she? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. I want to raise. Let's Phone go call. over. I'm about to go over to the film festival, so we'll be right back. Hello? Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We're here at the Nyack Film Festival. We're here to support Miss Monique Lisa, producer and star of Evulsion, and also Speed Suit with her son as the star. Let's go check it out. My name is Charles. They call me Charlie Brownskin. And, um, you know, me and my brothers, we put records out. We make music and we love it. And this is what we do. Um, this theater that we're at right now, we did a video over here. Now, we're here at the Nyack Film Festival and we just yes, watched Evulsion and Speed Suit. What did you think about the films? I like the suit. Yeah. And the boots. I know, You know right? what I mean? I'm like, yo, I need me some of them boots. Right. Because, Where can we get those, right? Word up. I'm trying to be out, too. You know yeah. what I mean? I used to get bullied as a kid, but now look at me. My brother, Jermaine Paul, he won The Voice 2012. Woohoo! Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, this year. So we're pretty much still living off of that and excited, you know? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Am I insane or do I really see heavens in your eyes? Bright as stars that shine up above you in the clear blue sky. How I worry about you, just can't get my thought up off you. And don't have no fear, oh, they wonder why I'm really feeling in the mood for love. Woo! A lot of talent in the house. Oh, yeah. Yes. We love you. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. All right. Thank you, guys. <laughs> well, I love the films. My name is Richard Quinn, and, and I run and produce here at the Nyack Village Theater. Also produce on Rockland World Radio. We've been broadcasting for 10 years. We've been in the theater for four years, right. and this is our first... Nyack Film Festival. All right. Well, congratulations. Thank you. My name is Monique Lisa, and I am the executive producer, writer, and director of All My Struggles, Speed Suit, and Evulsion. And I got to see a lot of the cast, like yeah. you, and I got to see um, Alan, who is the writer director of Speed Suit, and my mom was here, my sister, yeah. so it was really good. I love your mom. Oh, she was here earlier. We interviewed her. Yes. Yeah, she's a ham. 
<laughs> well, yeah. was a good feel. All right, well, first of all, thank you so much for including me in Evulsion. I'm going to show it in places that it seems appropriate for, but I'm working on several new projects as well as uh, the theater production. So prayers and, and, and all yeah. blessings and success with that. Now, Speed Suit is your full-length feature yes. baby with Ooh. your baby starring in it. Speed Suit was based on a book that came out in 2009, and Alan Paul Weaver III, he wrote the book. What I like is that the face of the bully becomes evident. Right. It, he's not just a bully, right. but, it, but it, it gets turned around, and it's yeah. like, well, he really does have a backstory. He really right. is someone who you can fall in love with. You actually fall in love with the, the bully at the yeah. end of this movie, so I kind of like that. Yeah. You know, I know in education as well, um, a lot of times bullies are bullies because they have been bullied, yes. you know, and they just feel like they want to vent or take it out on someone else. Now, he's not here, but Steven Strickland, uh -huh. he did his thing in both of them. He played a little bit on, he was edgy, yeah, 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 he played yeah, yeah. a little bit of the bad guy on both sides. We call him a script beast. He's yeah. just someone that can do two or three shows and play the lead yeah. in, in, in one show. He actually plays the lead in All My Struggles uh, for a couple of parts. And he's just someone who, he does what he loves and he loves what he does. That's what, yeah. you know, that's yeah, his, his that's saying. saying yeah. he, he, do what you love and love what you do. Um, he's just multi-talented and he's able to come across and be believable. And in Evulsion, it was a little racy for him. Yeah. You know, he had to be the person who caused the problems, yeah. but he was able to do that um, seamlessly. And yeah. I appreciate that, but yeah. extremely talented. Yeah. And I'd also like to thank Steve because that's how I met you. I was actually working on with with him on Love's Gonna Get You, right. and then he invited me to all my struggles, and I was like, "Weren't you rehearsing with us?" And like we were having shows, and you were doing this at the same time. And then I came to all my struggles, and I was like, "Wow, you know." And he was great there as well, and I loved the play, all my struggles. And you just got um, some recognition with that. So talk about that a little bit. Well, we were nominated for five awards in D.C., but recently. Most recently, we just were nominated Play of the Year Very for good. the first Playwrights Red Gala Carpet uh, Awards. Well, as a Caribbean sister, I just like to say thank you so much for putting these positive messages out because, you know, we need to definitely, you know, promote these positive messages and let people know that there are people who actually care about these issues that are going on. It's not always about, you know, shaking your booty and, and right. being half naked on stage, but it's actually about caring about, you know, real issues. Right. So thank right. you. Appreciate it. Well, DPTV, thank you for the interview and God bless. Just, just be a good example to, you know, show, you know, our youth that there's, you know, a better way. Right. Thank you, Mr. DP, and thanks for being here. Again, Claudia McLean signing out, DPTV. Have a great night. Okay.